There are more homes coming onto the market here in Central Florida, according to a newly released report from the Orlando Regional Realtor Association. Now, with that increase in interest rates showing signs of going down, West News Paola Tristan Arruda explains why some realtors are increasingly optimistic. The housing market has slowed down in the greater Orlando area. In November, property sales fell nearly 18 percent from October. That's based on data from a recent Orlando Regional Realtor Association report. But there's a chance that could change. Um, this is the season that's typically, um, at least in the last 23 years that I've been in real estate, that we see it um, slow down. But I think the other reason you're seeing that is because there is anticipation right now from the consumer um, that interest rates are falling and, and they did fall a bit. November's interest rate was down half a percent from October. And when it comes to inventory, for the first time since 2019, there is more than a four month supply of homes. It gives buyers more options uh, of homes to pick from. And we haven't seen that in a long time when um, the COVID lockdown happened. Compared to October, there's 5% more properties for sale. And while some homes are sitting longer, realtors say that the recipe for a stronger market is there. And I have a lot of several sellers in the pipeline that are ready to list in January. They're you know getting ready. And supposedly there aren't gonna be any more interest rate hikes until the, up until the election. So that's okay. promising. Buyers feel more secure. Realtors say the start of next year will be a busy one for buyers and sellers. So if you're thinking about getting a house now, I think you'll see that demand go up after the holidays. Um, and so again, I think if you're a serious buyer, this is a good time to get out there, make a little bit of time to do it if you're if you have the ability to do so. In Orlando, Paola Tristan Aruda, West 2 News.